Hey guys, it's Ropsy, back with Paperless Humans. Welcome to the fourth episode of this free Apple Reminders course. In this episode, we're going to focus on adding notes to your reminders. Sometimes days are not enough, especially when planning a complex project. You need notes to add important details to your tasks. To do that, you can go to the inspection icon and then under notes, you can start writing your notes. Or you can do it right below your task. I could add notes under my research task to keep track of all the information I am gathering from my research. The keyboard toolbar has some basic formatting options that let you select sections of your notes to make them bold, italic, or underline. On the pop up menu, you also have more formatting options, so by going to Format, you will be able to add bulleted lists, dashed lists, or numbered lists. Formatting helps add structure to very long notes. This note section of your task can only accommodate a maximum of 4,000 characters, which is about 500 to 1,300 words. On your list, the app displays some of the notes, but not all of them. So you have to tap on them as though you are editing if you want to see them fully. Instead of notes, you can add web links to the notes section of your notes and you can add as many as you like. Apple Reminders also has a dedicated slot for a web link. Go to the inspection icon and look for the URL slot which is labeled URL. This slot only accommodates one link though, but it's ideal for adding the main website you visit often for your task. So if there's a website that you continue going back to for this task, you'd want to add it here. Once you've added your web links, you can interact with them in several ways. Tapping a web link opens it in your default web browser on your device. Long pressing a link in your notes or right clicking it if you have a mouse like I do gives you options to open link, copy link or share it. You get slightly different options when you long press or right click on the URL slot. You can copy, share and also change the size of the thumbnail. Your URL thumbnail can be small or large. As you can see, web links look better when you add them to the URL slot instead of your notes. You also have the option to delete this web link that you have in your URL slot. One thing you get with long pressing, which you don't get with right clicking a web link, is a preview of the website. So all along, I was just right clicking with my mouse to bring up these options. But if you long press this, you can see a preview of the website. You can choose to hide this preview if you want by tapping hide preview at the top right corner of the preview window. And tap to show preview to bring it back up. Hopefully now you can add some useful notes to your tasks in Apple Reminders. Make sure you subscribe for more free courses on different apps. Thank you for watching. See you in the next episode.